Hugh McHuge demands human sacrifice in exchange for his powers. There's nothing like capping off a night of debauchery with the loss of human life. It all works out fairly good. Alright, we are back to the land of Hugh McHuge. In the stonk dunk religion, observing the donkeys apparently prey to Hugh McHugh, Jen, some of them just lounging about. It is a pleasure religion after all. So, what we can do right now, we have a, a fight coming up in three days. Which I'm hoping gives me a developing spark so that we come over here, and last time we got the festive debauchery, which is all great. But, we also apparently have... Oiled Prayer <laughs> in adoration, so... Those guys seem to be having a good time right there, just... Oiling themselves up and praying up to the Hugh McHugh. And we have joyful sermons as well. So, we'll, you know, we'll see if we pick up something like that. So how about we start off with, um... Well, you also have skills, right? Montezuma, I wanted to focus on... I believe with you, I really wanted to get this, just because it gives me a chance to stun. Let's go to Kiwi, and Kiwi's got one too. With Kiwi, I think I'm gonna go to Intimidate. Let's go out, prepare for our mission here. So, what do we got? We got these godless pagan heathens, right? All right. Well, let's do, let's see. It doesn't really matter, but let's stock up a cola here in a one-on-one -on -one situation. And then we'll put Montezuma up here in Ocelot here. I said Ocelot here. That should be good. What, what is increased material? Increase the stakes by becoming a mark? That doesn't sound too good. <laughs> Sin, I'm not gonna get you back. What the hell? Ooh. Convert two time to donkeys and gain treasure, but you start with 25 less HP, and the enemies are 25. Oh. Otherwise, I'm looking at. So I would get one more, is what you're telling me. And I would convert two times. I mean, am I really worried about these guys? Not really. But wait! There's more! You think I'm worried? The stonk donk never worries. Hardships bring me closer to Hugh McHugh. She, she or he is not wrong about that. Oh, oh wow, someone's already infatuated. Evade, evade, that's what's up. Okay, Ocelot, please. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, it's not looking too good. Ocelot, please, come on, do something. <laughs> Ocelot, you have disappointed me, but we have one. <laughs> Ooh, uh, Ocelot, we need to have a little one-on-one -on -one situation right there, because, you know, I'm just saying, that's kind of what I expected to happen to. I was telling you, like, if that guy with that giant machete, axe, whatever, attacks Ocelot, we could have problems. And you know what happened? We had problems momentarily. But fortunately for us, you finally have a class now. You're supposed to replace a cola? A cola the baller? <sighs> I don't know about that. But yes, that's what I'm going for, so Lust Priest it is. We got the extra tribute, which I'm happy about that. We got 75 and 75. We might have enough to build something we'll see. Stonk Donk is now at number 8. We're no longer in last place. Permanent upgrade to HP for the trial. And we get a relic choice as well. Very good. What do we got here? Choose a relic. Pick one of these relics to be created and preserved for generations. What do we want? We have Montezuma's letters. We have Ocelot's unbroken bone. Ah, uh, you know, I would kind of call it the broken bone, if anything, but that's just me. Akola's jaguar tooth. There it is. Montezuma's letters. That's done. Let's go and check out what our next destination is going to be. We have the Heartland still. We have six more tries before we actually have to do it. So let's uh, buffer dudes a bit more and then we'll check it out probably. I mean, it seems we might have some time after this one to do that. So we could probably hit that up afterwards. Be like a side boss before the actual one. So stubborn ignorance, okay. And we have a hundred materials now. Do we have enough to build something? Let us find out. Construct buildings. We could do the study now. We could also do a couple more temples, which would not be bad, and if we go to a holy site center... No, we don't have enough for the Divine Connection just yet. Preaching temple here. And where do I want this? That's the... the erection temple here, right? So, let's do the... the preaching one somewhere back over here. Keep our preaching and our erections apart from each other. <laughs> faith is broken after humiliation and sacrament. Lost one faith bond. The disciple will leave a religion after losing three. Well, you better not lose anymore, huh? 
So right now, your max fervor is one because your fate's a little bit low. Okay. Well, you know, I was all on you. I I, I told you not to be a scumbag, and you, you scummed away. Righteous flirt. Charisma. So you have nothing but righteous flirts at the moment. Sensual touch. Mm. Disciple base three, cunning bonus plus three. Isn't that what you're all about, cunning? No, actually. Oh, you know what? Because you're in a negative because of the max fervor thing, huh? Let's do the sensual touch. Okay. There you go, buddy. Got you a sensual touch, and we could even do a miracle for you. So how about we send you a... Actually, we should let this progress first, and then we'll do the miracle. Kiwi does need another ritual. I mean, keep working on that new one that we got. Seems it's gonna work out for you. And... Montezuma? Let's see about getting this ritual just about done. Ranked up. Matsuma's inspired to and to found a tradition of carnival. Human Huge will surely be pleased by this. A tradition of carnival? Sure. Well, we'll acknowledge the tradition of carnival. And since our mission is ready, you know what we should do as well? Are we going to use Ocelot this fight? No, because we have Ocelot for a mission uh, or a miracle that we should probably get that happening. Uh, let's go with more charisma. And we'll clear up that, or at least try to clear up the max fervor when we get back. So, right now what I'm thinking before we prefer this, which we have that item that we still haven't equipped just yet. Uh, we should give that to Montezuma because Montezuma has a negative 3 morale armor. So this here will give us a plus 10, so it puts us into a 7. Uh, I guess we'll match up here, here, and here. Not that we really have to worry too much about it. And sure, we'll even, we'll even take this materdom. Hey, handsome. Ooh, somebody's already seduced. A concussion. That's the other thing you should add to the ignorance. Concussions as well. Condemn. Defy that. People loving what we're doing. A little bravery action. Ooh, another one that's a little bit um, enticed there. What are we trying to get to, 60? Uh, we should easily be able to do that. Returns left. I think a, a cola, a cola should be able to get it for us here. Righteous flirt. Oh yeah. Went even above what we did, but we got it. 172 have been converted. We got the extra tribute chest as well. So here's what we do first. Let's go ahead and um, bring in our new disciple. And we have. Well, let's just reveal all of them. I used to think it was like one at a time, or. You choose one or the other, but now you can just reveal both. So we have Ate, 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 and Spat, Spat Lee. Devotion, good. Stats, five, six, four, eight, four, seven. Ate, what about you? I gotta be honest with you, that's really high might. And here's the thing, Montezuma, I believe, is 41. So, Kiwi isn't even like a replacer for Montezuma, because Kiwi is actually a chieftain. So... I think, you know what, we probably go with Ate instead. 15 years old, really young. Could be the replacement for Montezuma. Yes. You know what? Sorry, Sipali. Your facial hair was fairly intriguing, I will admit, but, um... Average, average. Yeah, you see, even the classes that they're favored for would be weak. So at least with Ate, we get an average one. Which will be the Rage Prophet replacing Montezuma. So, perfect. Welcome aboard! You're obviously gonna be just, uh, might, health, and cunning, right? Oh, yeah, I don't see a reason why you shouldn't be dancing for us. Get over to dancing! And then Kiwi... Let's continue... Blessing here. See, this is what we need to hit, um... Our boy Ocelot with, the Blessing of Recovery. So hopefully we get it here in this chance. Nope. Hume Huge thinks our parties are great at all. But you know what really would make a party unforgettable? Happen because of festive debauchery. Um, are you- are you- are you sacrificing people here? <laughs> Kiwi? Yes! Unlock a new tradition, human sacrifice. Do you- do you think that would really <laughs> make the debauchery even better? You know, let's end- let's end an evening of fornication with a human sacrifice, why not? Okay. You know, for once I didn't actually even suggest to myself, my- my disciples brought it up to me, so you can't even put it on me for this time. Can't be like, Falcon, you're up to weird stuff again, it wasn't even me! It was them. Uh, we did not get the blessing chance with Asa, unfortunately. So let's uh, let's keep working on. Yeah, let's work on Ate here. So you're not that weak for our next fight coming up. 
Akola's ranked up to C. Now, I wonder if I really, like, this fight coming up, 9, 16, 11, this one has a chance that what happened to Asa could happen to Ate, so I might be able to, I'm gonna, I might skip Ate for this fight, and just, uh, maybe do, like, one of the repeatable, that have, like, easier rookies for him. If I do that, I do it off camera, though, I don't want to farm on video. So, Akola, let's see. Akola, you're almost on your way out, I'll be honest with you. Still. Let's continue working on the good stuff for you, which is Kiss, because when you allure people, man, you bring the party over. Asala, there we go. Replenish that fervor. And let's go prepare for this mission. We have ourselves the Ancestral. I believe you are a Chieftain or a Rage Prophet? No, you're a Chieftain, because the Rage Prophet is the one with the axe. Okay. So, do I have anything that's strong against you? Not particularly, but you're not strong against me either way, so it doesn't really matter. Um, what do you think we say no to us, to uh, Akola here today? And, uh, we just try... ...them here. It's still damn well risky, but you know what? It's fine. I wanna have faith. Hey, um... Be happier. Akola's usually a very happy leader for us, Montezuma. Righteous flirt. Okay, very good. We got six. Just batch that dude. Ooh, that that hurt a bit. But so that oh, I think we got the stun. Yeah, buddy, that's what I was hoping for. So now you can do your thing first for a while. First to seventy wins. Very good. Okay, you're still stunned. Very good. So uh, as long as we keep that one out of the playing field for now, we're good. Another stun stack would have been amazing, but unfortunately, not happen. How we doing here? Anybody need to worry about being broken? A little bit. I need to see better from you, Ocelot, because you're the replacement owl. Ow, stop. Yeah! Yeah! Now they've lost a couple. And with it, with that person out of the way, everybody else doesn't really worry me at this point. Here's the last turn. Now the thing is, can we win? I'm not sure if we can. Oh, especially with that defy. Oh, we did! At the buzzer, baby. Hoo -hoo. Good thing we got that middle one broken. That was a closer one. Ocelot still has a lot of growing to do, obviously. Nowhere near the replacement numbers that, um... Akola puts up for us, but you know. Ocelot's growing. He was humiliated a while back, so, you know, his... He's gotta get his confidence up, you know? And we have enough now to do the tenant thing. Ooh, permanent upgrade, HP up. Yeah, plus 10 for all my boys. Very good. And following, we're coming up for the following right now, too. Okay, so let's do this before that. You can adopt a new tenant? Yes. So we did festive debauchery, which gave us the carnival and the human sacrifice. So that's been done now. Let's pop this open again. I kind of want to go... Each adopted tenant grants 25 permission. I mean, everybody's been happy so far because of the social, so I think we could probably deviate from it a little bit. And we go with the oiled prayer. Smoking truth leaves. <laughs> I bet that's what you're doing. Let's do the oiled prayer. Absolutely. God can only see you when your naked body shines brightly. And that's the reason why they're oiling themselves before they go into prayer for Hugh McHugh. The donkeys know exactly everything about the stonk down without me having to tell them a thing. It's it's beautiful. And we have our new tradition now unlocked as well. Human sacrifices or carnival, oh, I think. Uh, let's see here. Oh my god, check this out. Choose the disciple to become the master of sacrifice. The disciple will gain demand sacrifice, a strong ancestral morale ability that scales on might and lowers physical armor. And human sacrifice... If participating one, two, and four tribute chests, if you have one, three, six ancestral or divine disciples. Well, we do have ancestral for sure. Let's go with human sacrifices. Hugh McHuge demands human sacrifice in exchange for his powers. There's nothing like capping off a, a night of debauchery with the loss of human life. It all works out fairly good. Convert the elder, so we have 10 missions left for that as well. Let's choose our next destined mission. Which I guess should be down over here. Can we do some of these? Click to inspect. Now I guess we'd have to stick to the repeatable ones. Yeah, these are the, the, the weaklings over here. So we gotta level up my disciples. My new rookies on here. Okay. So... I guess until... Ooh, wait a minute. 
Oh, you're not strong against me. Good. As a matter of fact, I'm strong against you guys. <laughs> Let's pick that one up. Ate professes the merits of the oil prayer to the donkeys. Good. Good job, Ate. Well, unfortunately, I'm out of time. I'm going to wrap it up here for this one. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. As I've mentioned, uh, I'll keep doing more of these if you guys want to see more. And if something finishes by the time that... I'm still doing this, occasionally. We could just go ahead and substitute it if you want to see some more that is. So you guys let me know and um, we'll kind of go from there. We unlock a couple of new things here. Oh, the Master's Sacrifice. Oh yeah, we, we'd we have to definitely come back to do some sacrifices, don't we? <laughs> I'll catch you guys next time.